School districts across the valley are taking different approaches to bringing students back for in-person learning. Today, Madeira and Visalia Unified welcome back their transitional kindergartners through first graders. Kaylee Hunt with more on the first day back in class. After more than a year of not having students on campus, Madeira Unified welcome back these eager students. Putting an emphasis on doing this right and in this staggered approach so that our staff can really focus on bringing back our littlest littles. So our transitional kinder, kinder and first graders, they have the least experience with school and the routine of going to school. And they also may need the most direction in, you know, getting their temperatures checked, getting their screener accomplished. Todd Lyle with Madera Unified says on Thursday they will welcome back second through third graders. And Merced City School District currently has transitional kindergarten through sixth graders on campus for in-person instruction. 60% of our students expressed that they want to return to in-person instruction and just over 39% said they wish to remain in distance learning from home. Fresno Unified is still having small groups of students on campus until Fresno County reaches the red tier. They plan on returning to in-person instruction by April 6th. Visalia Unified also bringing students back this week. When they get to school, um, we ask students to bring water bottles because we have refilling stations, but all the drinking fountains are covered. There are one-way directional arrows in hallways, so it might take students a little bit longer to get to class. And Tulare City School District has had their elementary school students on campus since March 1st. And later this week, the district will bring back their 7th and 8th graders for in-person instruction. Kaylee Hunt, KC24, Local News That Matters.